Hi everyone, how are you doing? Kamal here and I welcome you all to the first hands-on video demo session of build 10586.11, the latest Windows 10 mobile insider preview build. We have previously told you that build 10586 is the RTM of the public release build and the new devices like Lumia 950 which are now sh being shipped to uh, owners are running the same build out of the box. So this 10586.11 is like uh, some kind of uh, variant or patched OS of build 10586. So uh, we have reported via sources that uh, the 10586 was having an issue of an issue of reboot loop. The build 10586.11 also has this kind of issue uh, that you can read in the known issues, but it's only in the cases where you have upgraded from the build 10581. So if you have upgraded from uh, 10581 and you have done a hard reset one build 10581, you need to, I mean, ideally roll back to Windows Phone 8.1 and then upgrade to build 10586.11. Now we have this build running on a couple of our devices and we will just demo how the build runs on the devices. So here I have a, a Lumia 525. And as you know, uh, I mean, it, it represents the low end of Lumia, the earlier generation, a previous generation. So we'll just see how the build 10586.11 actually uh, runs on this. So uh, you can see the lock screen animation. The app uh, responses are quite good. Apps open uh, fast. So not only that, we'll also see how the multitasking multitasking works here because uh, that is an issue when we have seen that uh, with Windows Phone 8.1 GDR1 with the preview build we have seen uh, some resuming issues which was like a kind of headache for many. So we will just try to see whether that kind of issue comes uh, with this build and since it's a RTM build, it's a quite should be good. So let's check it out. So till now we could have select like we have seen that the response of the app opening and then sending them to background has been quite good, positive. So let's see how now the app resuming works. Pretty good. So it seems that Microsoft has sorted out the multitasking and we don't see uh, resuming screens anymore. So the resume is really very, very fast. So here we can see uh, how the action center works and it's quite uh, homogeneous, quite uniform, consistent experience. It all works smoothly. Let's open some settings. So you can see the build number here. Okay. So to me, it looks like that the build is quite uh, smooth in uh, doing our handling things, which we do commonly. So like, and even that multitasking is proper. I have not seen uh, the build crashing or doing anything stupid or anything uh, exceptional, exceptionally bad actually. <laughs> The storage issue that we have seen on build 10581 was is fixed. Looks quite good. So you can see how uh, the build handles on uh, Alumia 525. Now we can uh, see how the 
build runs on a Lumia 640XL. So while usually the build would be expected to do quite well on high-end devices, so it's obviously the low-end and the medium range that one is really, uh, you know, more concerned about. So here we are. Obviously, uh, if you compare to the Lumia 525's experience, things look quite or uh, more, I mean, a bit faster on uh, Lumia 640, but that is expected given the difference in the processors. Now let's see how the multitasking works here. Quite instant. Quite instant. Okay. So multitasking is uh, looks quite good, especially on I mean even on five twenty five it was not uh, I mean it was not bad and on Lumia six forty XL it's quite quite good. I mean even. Uh, in case of Lumia 640XL, you don't see the apps uh, taking much time in opening up. Okay, so this is the group music that I just updated. So as you can see, uh, the build 1058.6.11 looks quite good if you uh, compare to any of the other builds, it's very fast, quite smooth. And even we have seen the multitasking on mid-range devices, it's quite instantaneous, quite, uh, I mean, the, the resume is very good, quite instantaneous resume. Even on Lumia 525, it was not bad, actually. It was working fine. There were no resume screens on even Lumia 525. So that way, the build looks good. We will have to see actually or run the build for some more time to find out bugs but if we see we don't can't see any visible bug as of now so that is a very good thing i think microsoft has worked hard on fixing the bugs before uh giving it or put i mean flighting it out so with that we come to end of this video we have seen uh, the build running on lumia 640 xl and lumia 525 and it looks quite promising uh, for i mean the, for a start it's quite good so uh, we will uh, run the build some for like more days and uh, we can actually then tell you the whole i mean kind of uh, long term kind of review on that but for now if you ask about our first impressions of hands on of this build on a uh, couple of devices then i can i mean we can just tell you that the build looks really really promising in terms of its uh, uniform uh, kind of and consistent kind of experience across the OS. The apps are uh, the open fast, 
the resuming from the multitasking is really good so and you don't see uh, crashing or OS freezing during the use so it's quite good we can recommend it as a daily driver so for more you can uh, stay tuned to NPU keep watching